Hey, hey, Taurus. Thank y'all so much for being here with me, tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is, so let's just go ahead and tap in with spirit. Get this tea for y'all real quick. See what's really going on in y'all's general collective energy. But please, Taurus, take what resonates with you and leave the rest. Also, whenever you come across this message, that is exactly what spirit has it for you. To all the uh, subscribers and members of the channel, thank y'all so much for rocking and rolling with me. I greatly do appreciate each and every one of you. Even if you're not subscribed or a member, Taurus, thank you so much for coming and viewing the message. I greatly appreciate it. I hope y'all doing well wherever y'all are in this crazy-ass world. But let's get into y'all's message. Let's see the message that Spirit has for y'all. Holy Spirit. Somebody could have Leo Holly aspected in a chart or you're dealing with one. But let's get into this. Ooh, y'all some very loyal individuals, huh? Yeah, we got healing right here. Some of y'all may be leaving behind a situation, but it feels like it's very emotional in order for you to do so. I don't feel like y'all want to do something, but it feels like it's something that you're being made to do. Yeah, somebody could have Sagittarius or Aquarius, highly aspected in their chart, or again, you're dealing with one. But let's get into this tour. Some of y'all could be healers as well. Yeah, work with different type of herbs. Also, it's something here about cough medicine. I don't know if it's you, Taurus, or one of your children, but I'm hearing something about cough medicine. Yeah, we have alchemy right here, and we have balance. Y'all are very good at transmuting energy, huh? Y'all ain't letting shit get to y'all at this time, which I can't even blame y'all. Taurus, you might want to close your bedroom or window because there's somebody right here. They're trying to look through it. Somebody could be very short, so this could be a child. I don't know. Because I see somebody trying to stand on something and balance themselves in order to see what the fuck it is you're doing. Holy Spirit. Yeah. Somebody here, I don't know what this is about chemistry. So I don't know if the something here is about homework. Somebody could be in school. Or it's just like studying, trying to figure things out, place things in the... I'm here in the right order. So some of y'all could be very busy at this time. Like, damn, your schedule is like rock. I mean, talking about solid book. If this is not, uh, you know, right now, some of y'all, I don't know if this is a business or what it is you're doing, but I see you being booked. I see you being like very, very busy here coming up. Yeah, something here is about somebody's hair. I don't know if somebody does hair, but you're, you're going to be uh, like, I heard double booked. So somebody here, you're going to have to like, I, I don't know if this is cancel appointments or hire help. But your business is definitely about to pick up. Yeah, I see somebody actually uh, getting a new car or something like that, too. Something about a cruiser or something. I don't know. Yeah, and then we get balance. We have two cars. We got balance right here during chaos, and then we got wizard. See what I'm talking about? Y'all are y'all the true alchemists. Y'all know exactly how to transmute energy into something that's beautiful for yourselves. So even in the midst of chaos, Tor is still out here motherfucking winning. Might be tired than a motherfucker, but you out here winning. Yeah. Holy Spirit. Can I get one more card for Taurus, please? Thank you. Yeah, we got sex magic right here. This is, you know what, Taurus? This is giving the energy of you and somebody. I don't know what this relationship is, but it feels zen as a motherfucker. It feels a little rocky, but it feels zen. You know what I'm talking about? It's like y'all, it feels like complete each other, but drive each other completely insane at the same time. What the hell? Yeah, so this could be the person, somebody could be, this could be somebody, the person that's watching you. Of course, yeah, look at them eyes. Somebody has beautiful eyes. Oh my goodness, yeah, passion, higher perception. Some of y'all could be very intuitive. I said healers earlier. Yeah, but this is giving like hair, makeup, lashes, things like that. So if somebody trying to, you know, get break into the beauty industry or something like that, it's something here that somebody is trying to find the perfect formula for. And I feel like you're about to get it. It's just going to be like a, a, a shit. You, you tried this, tried this, and then like, boom. And I feel like a big celebration. Somebody jumping around like, I did it. I did it. I finally got it. Got it. Got it. Yeah. So I don't know if this has something to do with hair. Has something to do with skincare or something like that. Could even be like a, a beauty uh, store for all I know. All I know is somebody out here, whatever it is that you're going for, you, you're going to do well at it. But yeah, there's somebody here. It's like both of y'all got them cards in y'all hands. 
this is weird. It's 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 giving though. I love the vibe that y'all giving off because it's even it's giving it like even though we're miles apart, we're still one type energy here. But boy, do y'all bump heads with somebody? Damn. But it feel like shit. You y'all bump heads, and then I ain't gonna lie, y'all don't stay mad at each other too long. Whomever you are. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a lot of passion between you and somebody. And also compassion. You see what I'm talking about? Not only is like the 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 sexual, you know, energy between y'all on point, it's like the emotional is as well. Yeah, it's like something about looking into your eyes. I'm hearing that Mary J's blog sound, look into my eyes. You can see what I see. So some of y'all have been through something in y'all in y'all time here on this earth, you know, at this lifetime. But it's like to look at you, you would never, you can't never tell what it is that you've been through. Hold on, Taurus. Okay, Taurus, sorry about that. Yeah, but let's get further into your your message here. Yeah. Also, I feel like y'all are very selective about who y'all hang around. And I feel like if you go out towards, you're not the type to stay out all night long. Yeah, even though you may look like, you know, the party type or, you know, you into the nightlife or things like that. Nah, people should never judge a book by its cover, especially not this tour. And I'm talking to because, yeah, somebody right here, it's like you're you can be the life of the party. You look very good. But at the same time, your ass is all the way balanced. Yeah, we get the two of Pentacles as well. Mm. Yeah, I see a Taurus leaving early. Like somebody like, oh, I gotta go to work. My kids gotta go to school. I'm not gonna stay out all night long or something like that. Holy Spirit, what's the alchemy choices? Yeah, make good choices right now. Uh, I was gonna call y'all Capricorn. Yeah, especially when it comes to your finances here. Make good choices. But this card says security. And I was telling y'all to close y'all blind. Uh, Taurus, you may have a peeping Tom. Yeah, I don't know where it is that you are. If you have security at your your uh at your residence, it could be whomever this person is that's supposed to be patrolling. They taking some type of liking to you and they always look at you or something like that. Yeah, somebody finds you very beautiful. Yeah, look at that. The cherry hit on the bottom of the deck. Yeah, I said something about getting a new car here. So you could go to like um, get a car and then a salesperson start flirting with you or something. Just be mindful of this. <laughs> yeah, we get Virgo energy coming through here. Yeah. Hmm. Y'all have been manifesting y'all asses off, huh? Taurus, just in case you were wondering, I do believe you are on the right path here. Something is significant about the month of September. Something is gonna be big for y'all in the uh in the in in finances around the month of September here. Yeah. I also see a, a, a Taurus making a decision to not smoke or something like that. That's also gonna improve your finances. You're gonna be able to save more. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, I see somebody taking some type of seminar or some type of class here. And it has something to do with your finances here. Some of y'all are really about to make some shit happen for y'all selves that is going to be really big. It's like a, a big transmutation of energy. I don't know what this energy is. Holy Spirit, can I get more on this alchemy the choices? Yeah, we get the five of ones right here. And then we get the death card. Yeah, it's like I'm speaking to a Taurus who got like a business idea. But it's like, I don't know if you don't see this, uh, a way to get this off the ground or something like that. So you're thinking about giving up. Spirit is saying, no, do not give up on whatever this is because it is going to come to fruition and it's going to be big. 
visualize whatever this is that you've been manifesting and praying for, asking for. Uh, visualize it, you know, like being here. Exactly. Dreams. I'm telling you, I see all your dreams coming true, like real shit. Hmm. I also feel, uh, Taurus, it's like there is someone here who, who wants to invest with you. But at the same time, this person could want to get to, you know, get close to you for a whole different reason. So there's that's something to watch out for as well. Hmm. Was, what's the balance? What's balance and chaos? For Taurus, what's balance and Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, we got the two of wands here. Your choices, exactly. And it, the alchemy says choices. So you definitely have a choice to make coming up here soon. This is about staying or letting go. This could be about business. This could be about a relationship. You know, something like that. But there is a choice here that you have to make. Mm. Yeah. Holy Spirit, can you need more balance and chaos? Yeah, the Eight of Pentacles. You can't make this up. Some of y'all, this has something to do with your work, your job, your career, or something that you just put a lot of time and effort into. But I see it being very successful. Whether it be a, a I'm hearing a long standing or long distance relationship, or if this is like a, a job, a business, somebody trying to get something off the ground. Yeah, I see some uh picking out of furniture or redecorating or something like that. I heard somebody say I'm decorating my office. Yeah, the ten of uh ten of cups right here. Very happy. Something that y'all have been waiting on is coming towards y'all. I don't know what this is, but it's like a a lot of shit is being balanced out here. Yeah. Taurus, and you know, I hate to say this, but I got to call the messages how I see it. There's a lot of people in the same uh, career field or industry or whatever this is that you're doing or that you're breaking into. Un like, fortunately for you, but unfortunately for them, the way that I'm seeing this card is you're going to be so successful that other businesses are going to have to shut down. Yeah, because it's like you're going to be on top. So it's going to be, I'm hurt. yeah, some businesses are going to go out of business once you get your shit up and running. Mm. Yeah, but you got to get up and actually decide to do this. I see y'all working on it, though. Somebody being very, very busy. It's something here is it's lighting a fire under your ass. I don't know if this is like a dream you had or a download or something like that. But whatever it is, yeah. See, that's what I'm talking about. Structure, discipline, things like that. Honesty, integrity. So it could be like your customer service or your, like your delivery. Somebody could be thinking about, you know, starting their own like little delivery service or whatever it is like that. I see this shit booming, Taurus. Some of y'all, it could even be catering or something like that. I see catering, some type of delivery. It's a daycare of some sort here. Yeah, this is going to go very well for you. Somebody could be, I don't know if this is like shit. For all I know, your ass could be learning to uh, get your CDL or driving a school bus. I don't know. But whatever it is that you're, you're working on, it's going to work out for you. Holy Spirit, what's the anatomy? Yeah, we get the temperance right here with the Queen of Wands. I heard when the time is right. Yeah, it's something here that y'all are passionate about. I don't know, something, something here is about a dispensary as well. I don't know what the hell is going on here. This could be about some type of weight loss uh, products, energy drinks. I don't know what this is, Taurus, but it seems like it has something to do with mind, body, and soul, like being on a Zen level. It has something, do some of y'all got Capricorn highly aspected in your chart as well? 
Mm. Yeah, I see somebody having a booming business with a lot of fucking employees. Holy Spirit. Yeah, running here and there and everywhere. I'm talking about very big. This is the third card of passion that we have out here. So it's like your ass is going to be abundant in, in uh, finances, career, love. It's just life is going to be great, Taurus. If it ain't already, life is going to be great. If your ass was celibate, you won't be for very much longer. If you don't want to have a baby, I suggest you use some type of protection as well. But yeah, Taurus, life is going to be great. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of people trying to patronize you or want to patronize you because it's something that you're doing that they're absolutely loving. Your energy is drawing people in, like seriously. Holy Spirit. Thank you. Yeah, we got the Queen of Cups here. <laughs> loving it. Loving what you do and everything else. Some of y'all, this could have something to do with your intuition. Some of y'all could be psychic. If this is what you do for work, fam, something here is going to boom for you. This could even be like a, a heightening of your intuitive gifts. And somebody here, you could become a clairvoyant, clairaudient, something like that. See shit before it even happened. Hold on, y'all. Okay, Tor, sorry about that. But yeah, you know, and also just a heads up, you got people out here that want to fight and argue with you over, I'm going to say, you're masculine. This is your masculine. They trying to fight and argue with you over your masculine and he don't want shit to do with them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tor, what the hell? Yeah, we get the five of cups right here. Yeah. To the seven of pentacles. It's somebody out here missing y'all. Yeah, I don't know what this person did to you, but you took your cup back and baby, this person right here. Somebody put y'all in a third party situation. This third party done fell through. Or the third party ain't what it cracked up to be or something like that. I really do feel like a third party did not work out because somebody can't get you off their mind. So this don't even have to be like you in a relationship with somebody, Taurus, because I don't see no relationship out here. I see somebody right here. It's like you're masculine. And I did her long distance earlier, so you and this man could be very much so separated. They could be with somebody else. Just know that whatever they got going on over there, wherever they at, it ain't working out because they can't get you off their mind. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah, we get the tower. Let's see here. We get the knight of pentacles, the ace of swords, to the tower. We actually go the tower to the ace of swords. Mm -hmm. There's somebody out here. I don't know what it is you're trying to build for yourself, but somebody here, they routinely try to tear down everything that you build Every, they try to pick apart your words. It's like a lot of shit that somebody's trying to destroy for you right here at Taurus. So that's why it's very important for you to put your alchemy draws on and uh, transmute all this energy. And that's the damn truth. Somebody, I don't know what it is you're doing, but it feels like a real exposure energy kind of. Mm. Hold on, Taurus. Okay, Taurus. Again, sorry about all the interruptions. Yeah, there's somebody that could be paying somebody here in order to, like, bring you down. I don't know what this is about knocking you off your throne or something like that. But it's like if they can't figure out this, if this don't work, then they go back to the drawing board and try to figure out this. They need to figure out that you're the fucking alchemist and you're going to always transmute every goddamn ounce of this negative ass energy that they trying to send towards you. 
You like the tower killer around this motherfucker. They be really trying though. <laughs> Holy Spirit, what's the sex magic? What's the sex magic here? Taurus, I heard it clear. You have somebody trying to have sex with you in your dreams. Spirit is like, don't let this happen. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles right here. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. You, you know what, Taurus? You have a um a kingdom spouse, uh, like a divine masculine, divine feminine, but you also have a spiritual um spouse, if that makes sense. But it feeling like your spiritual spouse can be like a little trickster. So that's something you have to watch out for. Yeah, because it's like a lot of chaos and confusion could be in some of y'all's connections. You know, not just one, but it seems like it seems to uh, follow you in every connection that you uh, get into. That's because some of y'all don't not only have a kingdom spouse, you have a spiritual spouse who's attached themselves to you. And it's like they stay claim and they don't want anybody else to have you. So who, whatever this spirit is. It will cause confusion and destruction in each one of your relationships in order to keep you single. If you, it's, it's like this spirit right here. It's like if they, if you're not gonna build with them, then you're not gonna build with anybody. So be mindful of your dreams at this time as well, uh, Taurus. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, we got the world card right here. Yeah, I feel like somebody always tries to astral travel to y'all in order to like um uh, um uh, sleep with y'all, like have sex with y'all. I don't know what this is about. Um, uh, it's giving a different meaning of spirit, baby. You know what I'm talking about. So some of y'all could have like a partner, and you are sexually active with this person. You know what I'm talking about? That's why y'all read it's turning into something different, but I'm giving y'all what spirit is giving me. You know what I'm talking about? But some of y'all, like I said, that spirit, that spirit partner, it's like um, this person will come in and sleep with you in your dreams and then all of a sudden you end up pregnant and you're thinking that it's the spouse that you slept with on the 3D level. That sounds weird, I know, but that's the message that I'm getting. Holy Spirit, thank you. Yeah, you can't make this up. The Empress right there to the Emperor. You cannot make this shit up like real shit. Y'all be mindful of y'all's energy at this time. Yeah, like cleanse your space. Uh, I'm hearing sage. Yeah. So that could, this right here, that's what I'm talking about. It's it's real weird out here because some of y'all do have a kingdom spouse, but you also have a spiritual partner. Oh, wow. I've never gotten that in the reading. Holy Spirit. Yeah, Taurus, y'all the first. I've never gotten that. Yeah, the judgment right here. <clears throat> Should I drop some knowledge on myself with that one? <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah, it's like some of y'all, this is another reason why some of y'all are waking up out of a dead ass sleep. Yeah, it's like spirit is protecting you from one thing or another. That's why spirit keep waking your ass up. What is this about somebody keep having to run to the bathroom? Yeah. Also, Taurus, if you live with somebody, get ready for somebody to start complaining about how hot a light bill is. Yeah. Yeah, high priestess. High priestess to the empress. Well, empress to the high priestess. Yeah, to the two of cups. And look at this. The seven. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all have a spiritual partner. And this person is causing, they're going to keep causing chaos and conflict in your earthly relationships somebody has stayed claim to you this could be even like you know that energy where um 
You know, you get real irritated, don't want to see your person, don't want to talk to your person, all this other kind of shit. You know what I'm talking about? This is because of this spiritual partner that you have. Be mindful of this. I know it sounds weird, but that's the energy that I'm getting from this. Some of y'all keep hearing about this uh, energetic uh, manipulation, and that's what it is. Some of y'all spirit spouse is very con uh, uh, conniving. And I hate to say that, but it's true. Because it's seeming like a kingdom spouse and a spiritual spouse. They are here completely fucking different. Mm. Yeah, I heard check the energy. Yeah, I'm telling y'all what I know, bro. Whomever this spiritual spouse, bro, look at this. If you ain't having kid, this part, this, y'all really need to Ooh, child, if y'all know somebody that do readings on that type of energy, y'all should really get one if this resonates with you. Because somebody here, you have a spiritual spouse that is refusing to let your ass be with anybody but them. And they're going to keep wreaking havoc. And that's the truth. They do it all the time. But anywho, fam, you know, a spiritual spouse, when I mean it's like a spirit that has taken claim to you like you're mine. Type energy, yeah. So, anywho, Taurus, that's the message that I have for you. If it resonates, check the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, y'all. Personal readings are open. If you're interested, Taurus, all that information can and will be found in the description box of the channel. It's always my pleasure, of course, Taurus. Thank y'all so much for allowing me to read for y'all. I'm sending you guys loving, healing energy wherever y'all may be in this crazy-ass world, Taurus, and we'll most definitely get back up.